and welcome to our What to Wear series. Today I'm going to be talking you through what to wear to the races. Everyone knows the races are a brilliant excuse to dress up and have some fun with your friends, but it's not always straightforward to know what to wear with fashion etiquette to consider. So I've put together these looks to help you stand out from the crowd and look like a winner, even if your betting slips do tell a different tale. Lace is timelessly elegant, so it's a great option for race day. I picked this mocha coloured dress because it's a really nice subtle colour and it's going to earn you some serious style points. The dress has a simple but flattering style on the front and there's a surprise cutout on the back. Cutouts can be a really effortless way to just show off a bit of skin and get that sexy edge, but the key to it is to make sure they're in subtle places. Keeping the accessories simple, I've decided to go for some silver stilettos and this really lovely soft clutch. Race day dresses don't have to be plain and simple. This patchwork print dress is going to really make you stand out from the crowd, especially when you're up against so many other colourful ensembles. I really love the way that this dress is cut. The all over patchwork print is really unique. The slash neckline really defines the collar and the midi length is really flattering. Just make sure that if you are going to wear a midi length, you definitely wear heels as it elongates your legs and also gives you some killer calf definition. For bags, because it's so printed, you want to keep them relatively simple. I could either pair it with this tan bag to make it a little bit more casual or gold to stand out. I think I'm going to go for the tan. A jacket shouldn't be overlooked when you're shopping for a formal occasion. A structured or an oversized blazer just like this one looks really great, especially over a slightly more feminine dress like I've done here today. Four colour blocks can look really stylish together, especially if the pieces are slightly different shades like this. The vintage style of this dress looks really great even with this lower heel, plus your feet are going to be a lot happier for it by the end of the day. I'm also going to add this black and white printed clutch to give it a little contrast just to finish off the outfit.